Hello everyone and welcome to another video from the Philippines. Today I'm going to talk about the topic many of you have asked for, the cost of building materials here in the Philippines. Recently I sat down with the foreman of our construction team to break down all the material costs in detail. We cover everything from the foundation materials to roofing, plumbing, electrical and even finishing touches like paint and tiles. Before we dive in, it's important to note that our house was built on Bohol Island and prices here can be slightly higher than in other parts of the Philippines. So keep that in mind as I go through the list. Let's start with the base materials for the foundation, sand. We paid 1,900 pesos per cubic meter and we needed six loads of four cubic meters each. Cement. Each sack of uh, cement cost 195 pesos and we used about 400 sacks of cement for the entire project. Gravel, similar to sand, it was 1,900 per cubic meter and we used 5 loads of 4 cubic meters each. Hollow blocks, this ranged from 18 to 25 pesos per piece and remember we had the thick walls like the 16 centimeter hollow block and you have to also add the delivery cost for that. Next, we used steel bars for the reinforcement of the walls, 60 mm steel bars, we used 90 lengths which cost about 355 pesos per length, 12 mm steel bar, we used 45 lengths of this, 218 pesos each, 10 mm steel bar, some of them for binding, we used a total of 200 lengths, 175 pesos each. Moving on to the roof, C bars for the roof frame, 1 mm by 2 inch by 4 inch C purlins, 52 lengths of 920 pesos each. 1 fourth by 2 by 2 angle bar, 25 lengths of 1500 pesos each. 3 16 by 1 and a half by 1 and a half uh, inch angle bar, 16 times 1500 pesos each. Then we come to the roof panels, they are 1 meter by 5 meter, these were about 4000 pesos each. For protection we also needed some paint for the steel bars, uh, around 6 gallons were required, costing between 1100 and 1500 pesos each. Let's talk about the painting of the house, we used about 40 gallons of paint for the whole house, each costing between 700 to 900 pesos each. Skin coat. To smooth out the walls we used 3D bags, that is a powder, which cost about 500 pesos each. For the windows we opted for aluminium frames and the aluminium windows sized by about 180 by 120 centimeters cost 8500 pesos each and that is the price from the builder store. Next, the plumbing and the wiring materials. The red PVC pipe for wiring we used 28 lengths of half inch pipes and 6 lengths of 3 fourths inch which cost 120 pesos each. Wiring. It's called THHN THW stranded copper wire 3.5 mm that's one box maybe 50 meters per box uh, which was 5500 pesos the box. Then the THHN THW stranded copper wire of 8 millimeters, 33 meters we need, 439 pesos per meter. Waste pipes, about 100 by 100 millimeters by uh, 6 meters, cost 1100 pesos each and uh, 50 millimeters by 6 meters cost 800 pesos each. Fittings like elbow and connectors range from 100 to 200 pesos each. For the water pipes we used PPR pipes and 5 lengths of PPR pipe at 300 pesos each and PPR fittings at 30 pesos each. Some fittings have a metal inlay, we paid 100 pesos each. Finally, let's talk about the finishing material. For the tiles of the house, we used 60 by 60 tiles, uh, which cost 159 pesos each. The one from the bathroom, a little bit smaller and also a little bit cheaper, uh, I think it was about 80 pesos each. 
for the wall tiles. That all about covers all the major materials we used for building our house. If you think I missed anything or if you have uh, feedback on the prices, feel free to leave a comment below. It's always great to hear from others who've had experience building in the Philippines. Thanks again for watching, don't forget to give this video a like, subscribe to the channel for more content and I'll see you again in the next video from the Philippines.